How's it going everyone? We're here to check out the skins that have made it in this week and it looks like we've got the Damascus set continuing with the road sign gloves and boots and the gloves here are going to run you the usual 99 cents as you would guess and so will the boots and this design of the boots is just really cool like I mentioned on the video earlier this week it just kind of has this old kind of metal sandal look from far away and I think that just makes them very unique looking and especially the sculpting here on the front as well so you can pick it up for just under two bucks for the set of both of them and then just real quick we'll take a look at the gloves this way There you go. Next, we've got another continuation of some more armor for you, and it is the Cyber Armor. So we've got now, in addition to the metal face mask and chest piece, we now have the Cyber Helmet. Cyber Armor, because the other one I think was Cyber Chest. And then Cyber Kilt. So there you go. Uh, if you like this set, then it's a nice continuation in with it, and it just kind of has this nice little metal paneling going on. And uh, all memes aside, it is actually a pretty cool looking set. This week we don't have any deployables, so we got weapons and armor for you. The first thing up here is going to be the Nomad MP5, and this thing has a cut sight. So look at that, 249, and you can get yourself a pretty crazy sight on an old rusty crusty gun. A lot of people always complain, ah, a lot of this stuff is too bright and doesn't fit even the name. The name of the game is Rust. Well, here you go. Here's a rusty one, and it has special sights. So, hey, this is definitely a good buy for the people who are interested in collecting or just like those awesome extra sights. Then over here, we've got the Thunder Gold Star. Nice continuation in the set. As you can see, it is a stockless Star. Has all the bling of everything you would expect from the set, of course. Aiming down the sides here, you have that kind of white silvery against the gold for the tip. And there we go for our reload. Last but not least, we have the Serpent AR. This one's going to run you the usual $1.99 weapon price. And has this really nice kind of painted design of this crazy serpent. You can see its head down there on either side. And it looks like Helk went with the stocked version. We showed you the stockless one in the video. So this one does have a stock that's worth mentioning. Aiming down the sides here, you do see another kind of snake painted on the back and some black. Well, it's almost like a dark, 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 dark blue green, but black against red pretty much for the sides there. And there we go for our reload. Now there is one thing worth mentioning, the Nomad MP5 is a double up on a name. There's already a gun called the Nomad MP5 in the game, so most likely it will change its name. But it'll just take time for Steam to update that. So yeah, you might be like, wait, Nomad, I don't see it, what's the name? Yeah, that might be why. So there it is everyone, sound off. Tell me what you picked up, or if you didn't, why, and what you wish would have been there instead. Thanks for watching, and stay rusty.